It is a $91 billion spending plan, and it is the product of months of hard bargaining in Tallahassee. The formal vote on it will be held tomorrow afternoon, ending Florida's legislative session. Kent Justice has been following the process at the Capitol and shows us how two local lawmakers have been key players. The House spent Friday debating the budget. The Senate introduced and then debated all of that talk in heading downhill toward the budget vote scheduled for Saturday. In the House of Representatives, it's been Travis Cummings. And the reality, Ken, is it's a, you know, over $90 billion budget, a lot of needs. In the Senate, it's been Rob Bradley. This is my seventh year in the legislature. This is by far the most productive uh, session we've had. It's been a great session. Both are from Clay County and both serve as their chamber's appropriations committee chairman. And they have worked through the details of the largest budget in Florida history and seem eager and relieved to see the process wrap up this weekend. What happened in this budget session, uh, unlike perhaps some others recently, is that there was a commitment on the part of Speaker Oliva and President Galvano very early on uh, that we were gonna break the mold. There was not going to be um, unnecessary tension between the House and the Senate. We feel good about our accomplishments there. We obviously, uh, you know, uh, record spending with environment and education, but uh, as the Senator said, we've, uh, we're ready to go home, but uh, we feel that uh, we're proud of the outcome. There was contention, contention. there was disagreement between uh, Chair Cummings and I at various points, but we just worked through it and powered through it, uh, really drawing on uh, the strength of our relationship, which goes back almost 20 years. Uh, but he and I worked through so much, and I think they uh, fortunately had a lot of trust in, in what we were doing and that we were representing not only their interests, but the interests of uh, both the House and the Senate uh, as well. Senator Bradley and Representative Cummings are in line to hold those same appropriations chair positions next year. They say to get started on that happens very soon. In Tallahassee, Kent Justice, Channel 4, the local station.